What is up, YouTube? Hold on, let me brush my hair down. Yes. What is up, YouTube? It's your girl, Allie in the cut. What the fuck was that? I think that was a piece of water. I said piece of water. Do not mind this bump on my lip. I don't know where it came from. And no, it's not no STD. It's just I woke up one morning and it was there. Thank you. Not even one morning. I think I woke up yes, no, yesterday. Like, I think it's a stress bump. I think it is a stress bump. I think this is a stress bump. I think this is a stress bump. I really do. Because it just popped up in the middle of me working. I think I'm going to go down to the store so I can get some um, some lash glue and stuff so I can do a little tutorial and promote the lashes a little more. It's something to, you know, get my mind off of what's going on right now. I'm going to get back to you guys once I get in the car. Um, so stay tuned. Oh, All right, guys, I'm in the car right now. Let me turn down. Let me Damn, it's hot as a bitch in here. Life is crazy right now. And you can definitely see that bump on my damn um, lip right now. I'm definitely gonna be home for the majority of today. I just wanted to take you out, take you guys out with me. Oh, yes. Hold on, baby, hold on, we're gonna have to park. Hopefully nobody coming, hold on. Okay, so I'm back, but I had to take a picture. Hey, big ass truck, go. So stupid ass. Damn, not this fat ass, big ass, hybrid ass, fuck ass shit wanna. Like, bitch, I can't fucking see now. My way to this dollar ass general. This is why I should have speeded up and I should have went in front of this hoe because his stupid ass going slow. Look at that undercover cop right there looking stupid. Oh, I'm gonna park right here, baby. Right fucking here. Right here, baby. And your girl is a straight parker. Don't don't ever come for me with that. All right, so I'm about to go get some eyelash glue, some pomade, and that's about it. And I'm about to go back home. We're gonna stop somewhere and get like a slushy, but that's about it. All right, y'all. So I decided to go to Walmart instead because, for one. This a dollar store ain't got shit in here. All right, y'all. I decided to take my wig off because, I mean, I'm going to put it back on anyway. First off, you're going to start just by, um, you know, shaping it how you want it to look. So once they look the shape that you like, you're going to take a sip of your juice because you're thirsty. Mm, that's good. Get your angled brush and dip it into... All right, so at this point, I just decided to do a voiceover because I felt like it was gonna take too long for me to explain what I'm doing. So right now, I'm just filling in my eyebrows. Well, I'm actually just aligning it. So that's what you see me doing. Yes, girl, do what you gotta do. Mm -hmm. So yeah, make sure you outline it and don't use a whole bunch of pomade because then it'll be too dark and you'll look weird and that's not cute okay so and now i'm just looking at myself or whatever now i'm using this little q shit to um even out my eyebrow so it's not like weird and now i'm just using the concealer using maybelline color honey to arch my shit and now i'm doing it to the top <laughs> Oh my gosh, doing it to the top part, you know, you can't just do it to the bottom, gotta do it to both, baby. Okay, all right. All right, so now I'm just blending it in with my drugstore brush from Walmart. Y'all see this all the time. Okay, now I'm just looking at myself like, damn. Um, and I'm doing the other eye now because, and this eye actually came out a little bit more, you know, fat. So I had to like really contour this one because it was a little thicker than the other. So, I mean, that concealer always comes through though. So I wasn't worried.
all right so now i am concealing that part too so that they both look alike eyebrows looking good right now girl i like that they're looking good okay and this color isn't really my color but i mean it's what we had to work with so it's whatever now i'm just dancing because i'm happy because my eyebrows look a little good now i'm just getting rid of that eyebrow and going back in with my little q shit so that i can blend it and make the front part fade so it's like my eyebrow now i'm going to get my master prime maybelline to make sure my face is not like you know has pores all over it and make sure you are not doing too much. This is also a good thing to do before you put on your foundation, of course. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. Okay, so now, yeah, we're going in with the foundation. And now we're going in with the concealer. Dang, I'm going fast in this video. Can't keep up. Like, the voice, the voiceover can't even keep up. I'm like, I'm doing this and doing that. All right, so now we're just blending in the concealer. You already know. And we're going in with my Airspun setting powder and we're just setting it. I don't use a lot of powder on my face because um, I don't, I don't wanna look like a ghost. So I use like only the necessary amount that I feel like I need to. Now we're going in for my e.l.f. palette using that dark color right here. And before we do that, we're gonna go back in with the Maybelline and we're gonna contour and prime our eyes. So yeah, now we're doing the smoky look. And on the um, outer crease of our eyes so that it makes it look a little more, you know, defined. And now we're going in with another color. Um, I was thinking if I should do the pink color or the other color. But I was like, whoa, let me do this pink. And it came out looking good. So I was like, okay, <laughs> let me go ahead. So yeah, now I'm just brushing it in to there. Sorry, y'all, I'm smacking. But now I went back in with the, uh, the color right next to it, the lighter pink. I actually didn't end up liking this pink color because it looked a little too, like, dusty. And so I changed it later on in the video. And now I'm going in with my highlighter to um, contour my eyebrow, make it a little more popping. I need my eyebrow to pop. All right, so now we're doing the other eye as well. Can't just leave one eye out, baby. No, no. Okay. So now I'm just going back in with the palette to fix my eye. And I think, I, did I go back in? I forgot what color I went back in with. Okay, now I'm going back in. I'm showing you guys the color that I'm going in with. And that is the brown color. So that it um, kind of helps it to look a little better. So now I'm just dusting off the setting powder. Because ain't nobody want to look a ghost. And I really do have to dust off this powder. Because if I don't dust it off correctly, I'll look like a ghost. Now we're going in with the uh, Wet n Wild highlighter and we're using that for the inside crease of my eyes because I like the way it looks. And we're going in again with that sparkly color because I didn't really like how the way it was making it blue. It was making it like a little blue. And I was like, I don't have no blue on me. And I was like, you know what? Okay, let me go in with this gold color and put it underneath, make it look a little better. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm um, underlining it with that coral orange eyeshadow. Now we're gonna do eyeliner. You can't have a look without eyeliner, baby. You gotta have it. You ready for what it is. All right, so I'm just making sure that shit is pointing. And now, I am just looking at myself. All right, so now I'm adding more highlighter because I'm like, okay, I need some more highlighter. Mm -hmm. All right, put it on both sides, not just one. All right, so now these are my eyelashes for my company, and this is the Kiss um, Lash Glue, and that was the Urban Decay that I'm using right now. This is Urban Decay. I'm using the darkest color in their palette. I'm not sure what this palette is called because it was a gift, but... Um, I'm using the darkest color they have. So, I also try to cover up my bump too with this, but <laughs> I don't know, it made me look like a clown. But now we're just adding lip gloss and the eyelashes. 
eyelashes. I didn't really show you the eyelashes, but now we're putting the eyelashes on and now I'm feeling myself. Oh, now we're going back in with the Kylie Jenner palette because I wanted to make it a more sexier look. So I'm using the rose gold that they had and now I'm just putting on some mascara to make it blend and whoop. <laughs> uh -huh, yeah, there we go. Y'all was ready for that surprise. This is a Juliet wig. I cut the bangs off too short, so now I just use it as like a, you know, if I have to go somewhere quickly. And then I'm putting on my bandana to make sure that y'all can't see that top part. So I look a little good. <laughs> you know what it is, and that's it, y'all. All right, and I'm just brushing my hair, and that's it. All right, y'all, thank you for tuning in to this today's vlog and mini tutorial. Hope you guys enjoy this video like and subscribe leave a comment if you like Ooh. all right bye y'all